What secrets? There's an advantage to having been concealed in a tomb when your ancestors fled. Unlike you, I was alive at the time. I know how everything happened. I was not fed propaganda like yourselves from your parents. Are you not on our side? I will help you. And then I shall explain the full truth to my grandson when he is awake. But first, we must reclaim that scepter. And what if he doesn't wake up? I mean, he'll have died having been given the shock that his whole life was a lie. Believe me, this changes nothing. It changes everything for him! This quest to reclaim Ninjago all boils down to his hatred for the fact that it was a man who was close to the first Binjutsu master who cold-bloodedly killed his grandfather down to the fact that he disagreed with this technological agenda. When you learn the truth, you will realize this quest is still very much valid. Now get down in that ocean and find that scepter! Mortem, it'll be best for you to stay on land so you don't lose strength as quickly and to keep Stackola safe. Having a sorcerer on our side makes things so much easier. Now where is the scepter? Follow me. Now, let's get back to the surface and wait until the final day of their celebration to strike. Why not attack now? Listen, you do as we say. We have everything planned out. Nothing is without meaning. And the people of Ninjago shall soon learn that. Besides, we need to practice how to use this. And not rob Stekor the opportunity of missing everything his life has been leaning up to. Very well. And then I can tell you, all of you, the truth behind the lies you have been fed your whole life. <laughs> two weeks of solid practice have paid off, and only two days have passed in Ninjago. Need I remind you, we've been down here for a lot longer than two weeks. We're still pretty new to this new fire thing. <laughs> Speak for yourself, boy. I'm ready to chop suck in this lemonade stand. Just a forewarning for you all. The ninja we fought, they're insanely strong, and they know Spinjitsu. We will need to change these suits as soon as we escape. We'll need our powers if we have any hope to stop them. And, uh, maybe a quick stop off back home to, uh, clean up. <laughs> <sighs> what the heck are you doing? I should ask you the same thing! The ninja did not put us here. You all need to realize that. I heard it, from the first Spinjitsu Master himself. The Realm Prophecy, we were all told, was a function designed by himself. The Cursed Realm and Jinjago were to inevitably fall. That what was the ninja's fault, however, was how the Cursed Realm fell. You see, this was a test, to see how the people of Ninjago would react to such a threat. It has caused many problems. I'm sure wherever he is now, the first Binjutsu Master realizes that. But you all need to realize that if we don't free the ninja now, Ninjago will be laid to ruin. I heard those ninja plotting, plotting to wipe out Ninjago, bringing it back to its once glorious past. The past is the past, and what a beautiful time it was. But the future is now, and we must fight for it. So take a stand, help me break out my friends, and I guarantee you, all of you, the price of freedom, 
a ticket to the departed realm, and an end to your pain. If your brother were here tomorrow, he would never give in to such petty lies. My brother is in the departed realm because he abided and saw the light. Guldar, one piece! Guldar, help ninja! Guldar, fight! We may have had a rough past, and our quarrels may have all led back to us being homeless, thanks to the first Spinjitzu master. But we fought for rights, not power. If we can put everything in the past, we can all make a difference. For Ninjago! Well then, what are we waiting for? I thought we were all itching to get back into action. Stikor, can you hear me? What is the real reason you're here, Samurai? I... I, I told you already. Then what did you want with the Scepter? Evidently you weren't planning on waiting and testing it out on our prisoner first, like we instructed. Uh, I... You wanted to wipe us out so you could unleash this scourge on Ninjago yourself! Well, joke's on you, pal. We already have many members of our clan out in Ninjago, hiding in plain sight. They've been there for years, and they know that when all technology is wiped out, that it is time for him to come out of the shadows and fight with us once more. Come on, Stranger. Let's show him to our face. Stakul, please, wake up. Ah, please, don't. Please, don't. I, 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 I'm too weak. Be lucky that Mortem is not here, for he will slowly but surely ensure you suffer the same pain you put him through. Please, I'm just a helpless old man. Again I ask, have you no morals? So was Mortem, but that didn't stop you kidnapping and running tests on him, deforming him so much that his skin withered away. Get ready, Ninjago, for once this scepter has been mastered, all technology shall be wiped from any existence. Yes, yes it shall. Anyway, tomorrow, precisely when the celebrations end, Ninjago shall be restored back to glory. Quite the combo, my ninja. Woo! No, no, Gatekeeper. We can explain. No need. No! Uh, we, uh, we Titans are connected through a hive mind. I heard it all. So why did that fire demon try to stop us escaping? It was his assigned purpose. You were still cursed, and therefore he had to try and stop you. I can only lift the curse if you aren't in hell. Wait, Wu, where's Misako? The ninja. They threw her in hell. What? Gatekeeper, open the gate! Lloyd, I, I have an easy- Open the gate! Now! Moro, come on, help me! Lloyd, are you sure? Come on! Gatekeeper, what was your easier way of getting them out? Where is everyone? Well, I promised them freedom, and the Gatekeeper heard that. I assume he lifted their curse and freed them to their pardon realm. Lloyd! What do you want, Flamzor? The curse has been lifted. 
You can't track me down here. Kai! Nia! Their comms devices are all down. Where are they? Right. Ninjago City is having a celebration due to last night's eclipse. It ends tomorrow. And? The blacksmith shop at the Temple of Ojitsu had a smashed window. Someone must have kidnapped the ninja and is preparing an imminent attack on Ninjago City. We gotta go and warn them. Oh, I don't think so. Maya, don't move. Everything is proceeding as intended. Our clan members are moving into position. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What are you doing? Please, wake up. <laughs> what are you doing? I am the sorcerer of death. And I'm giving Stakor a near death experience. What? Stop! Modem! You idiot! Why would you do that? That's why. Well, we better go get that scepter. You were out for quite some time, my friend. What? The last thing I remember was walking out onto the ocean. You look at me, doesn't remember. You will not tell me. Or else I'll kill you. He deserves to know. There's a good samurai. Well then, tomorrow, we finally launch our attack. Our kingdom shall rise once more. <coughs> uh, stop it! Lloyd? Uh, Flamzor, you? Yes, Lloyd. Hold on. Yes! Now then, Gatekeeper, curse those other ninja! I'm afraid that's not possible. Why not? I can only curse people once they have entered hell. You'll have to get them back here and get them through the gateway in order for me to do so. <sighs> but we don't have our powers! Last night's eclipse began a three-day celebration in Ninjago. Today is the second day of that celebration. The ninja will attack tomorrow. We have time for you to equip with new suits free from Vengestone and return here to stop the ninja's attack. Well then what are we waiting for? Let's go save Ninjago.